Singapore is investing millions more in research to emerge stronger from challenges like COVID-19 and climate change. It's pumping $25 million into tackling rising sea levels. Another $2 million will go into a first-of-its-kind project, analyzing big data to study the impact of the built environment. The search for solutions to shore up coastal defenses heats up with a new $25 million initiative that's led by the National Parks Board. It will dive deep into how the phenomenon affects marine life and find ways to protect the coast using engineering and nature-based solutions. The program will also study what's called blue carbon, which is the carbon that's captured by marine ecosystems to reduce Singapore's carbon footprint. It's part of a new research area on greening the city. The country is also looking to build faster, smarter and safer as the pandemic hits construction timelines. The Housing and Development Board and ASTAR will develop a system that uses 5G to deploy drones and robots at construction sites. Using laser scanning technology, they can reproduce a 3D model of the environment to help with visualization. They can also detect and send alerts about lapses in real time. The two agencies will promote industry partnerships to commercialize solutions. $2 million is also being set aside to build up capabilities in urban social sciences under a study that's being led by Nanyang Technological University. It will use big data analytics to identify emerging social trends and explore how the built environment affects residents' well-being. Findings will contribute to city planning strategies. We are investing in R&D to find new ways of making our city more sustainable and resilient. This will also support the growth and transformation of our built environment sector and create attractive jobs for Singaporeans. We want to ride on our current momentum, foster more partnerships with our industry and create a more vibrant ecosystem.